G'day, g'day. Now, one of the things I insisted I put in this new boat is an autopilot. Now, a few people have asked me, why would you put an autopilot in a boat that's less than six metres long? Because traditionally, it's only the bigger boats that had autopilots. But it is a fantastic advantage, especially if you're a fisherman. One of the things I like to do is pick a spot, maybe a kilometre or so ahead of me, set the autopilot on and trail lures to that point. Also, I could set up a course, maybe zigzag across a reef, put the autopilot on and it'll actually follow that course, allow me to cover a lot more ground. Particularly good if you picked up a fish on the last trial. Another thing is it's really good on fuel saving. The autopilot, pretty accurate this one. I can set it on a course, I do a lot less kilometres to get where I'm going and a lot less fuel as well. Now I'm on autopilot. The autopilot's taken over the steering. It gives me a little bit more opportunity maybe to play with my sounder, have a bit of a look around, spot schools of fish that might be out there, maybe even clean some fish. It really does give you a second set of hands. And when I decided to put an autopilot on the boat, I went to the people that make them, an Australian company. They make them right here in Brisbane. That's TMQ. Let's now go and have a chat to Jason from TMQ. He's been involved in the installation and the setup of this machine from the day one. TMQ AP47, uh, we specifically designed for trailer fishing boats uh, from five metres, typically up to around that 10 metre mark. Uh, this autopilot is designed to give an extra set of hands at the helm, okay? So if you want to be busy doing something else, be it prepping rods, prepping your bait, this thing will steer the course you've desired. It'll hold that course more accurate than most helmsmen. The development of this product um, took over 18 months. It's a brand new concept for TMQ with regards to not having a rudder feedback unit. And a rudder feedback unit on a trail boat is typically the hardest part of an install. So TMQ have designed this pilot that it can be used with or without a rudder feedback unit, simplifying the installation uh, of the autopilot and also the operation. So if you're a fisherman and you love fishing Morton Bay and offshore, consider putting an autopilot in and when you do, make sure you go to the industry experts, TMQ. I don't think I'd actually consider water skiing on my own, but they are a great advantage, gives you an extra set of hands.